What is going on guys? Devinator here back again and look what we have here. Episode 4 we're bringing <coughs> new overlay to the gameplay. I'm, let me move a few things. I wasn't quite ready for this. But here we are. As you can see, quick team recap. We have Marsh Stomp level 20. Marsh Stomp level 20 water ground type hustle ability with the moves tackle mud shot mud slap and water gun uh lily or credilly is dead we gotta deposit her we got flareon with the shadow tag which prevents the foe's escape with fire type with tackle tail whip helping hand and sand attack we got beauty fought beauty fly at level seven move absorb she is a bug he is a bug flying type of the ability shed skin and then we got ghastly the ghost and poison type passes on status problems and with hypnosis and lick how are y'all doing welcome back to the street or to the channel i'm gonna go ahead and take the lucky egg off of, uh uh credilly is dead and we're gonna give give flareon the uh lucky egg so, we defeated Roxanne last time, so we're going to go heal ourselves. Oh, there it goes. Here comes some story. Don't take my goods. So, let's uh, go heal ourselves here down at the PC. But how are y'all doing? Welcome to the stream, or welcome to the video. I keep saying stream for some reason, but welcome to the video. I hope you all do enjoy the overlay that I got going on here. Um, don't forget to deposit Cordelia. Yes, cannot forget to do that. And this is just something new that I'm trying out. Hopefully it works. Uh, it looks great. I, I spent a very long time. Uh, I can't withdraw. I've got to deposit. I spent a very long time uh, creating this. It may not seem like it, but it was kind of difficult. And I hope to... Uh, continue this on with like all my other stuff like that I do like the Skyrim one I want to create some kind of something so let's go uh, oh it's you you're that fantastic trainer help me in Pedalboard Woods help me I was robbed by Team Magma I have to get the Devon goods back if I don't I'm going to be in serious trouble well it sounds like you shouldn't have let the Devon goods escape your grasp like that oops so let's do just a tad bit of grinding with Flareon up front and with him holding the lucky egg. Uh, let's go ahead and just and do that. Because I want him to learn some fire type moves. Because, you know, that's what I want. I want some coverage. I need some coverage. This shouldn't do much to us. And I don't know what game we're going to play after this one. We could play one of the older ones. I really haven't played many, like, I've played some, but I've never really played many of the games as much as I have this generation. Third gen is my favorite gen, by far. The Ruby is one of the games that I grew up with. Okay, so we got a Poliwag. I'm gonna try and run. Good. I don't, I don't want to risk anything. It should be fine, but I'm not trying to, like, risk anything at all. Ooh, a bigger off. That would have been a good Pokemon to have slacking if it didn't have the loafing, the truant ability. Let's go ahead and tackle this thing to death. Excellent. We should get some good XP. 162. Flareon is 14 now. Got some good, got some good stats, just not exactly where I want to be. I'll probably grind up just a tad bit more and uh, then we'll go on about our way. We could have got a feed ass, which would have been pointless. They don't learn like anything. Wow. <laughs> one shot. So Flareon gained like no XP. Let's uh let's continue to go this way. Uh, how are y'all doing? You got a Loudred? And tackle. This is the only attacking move that we have for Flareon. It does quite a bit of damage. And we're not there's nothing that can really hurt us too bad. This route, I don't think. 162. All we need is a few more of those. This lucky egg makes a difference for real. Then we got another Loudred. 
Tackle? If you guys are enjoying this series, be sure to subscribe, hit the notification bell so you can stay up to date whenever I upload. Uh, and be sure to check out uh, some of my other stuff. I got a few other things that I'm working on right now. Uh, Skyrim Let's Play. And check out some of my other stuff of my Call of Duty Modern Warfare montage clips. I've got a Need for Speed Heat playthrough. Um, I do all kinds of stuff, but I'm going to be more focused on this direction, I think. Uh, Alright, this is a direction that I've wanted to get into now that I feel like I'm finally getting comfortable enough. I've got everything set up the way I want it to be. And I'm constantly going to be improving the channel in this aspect. It's going to be super easy. Um, now I've made the overlays. I've kind of gotten my hands dirty in that. So I've, I've kind of gotten a feel for a lot of the things that I need to get a feel for to be better in this kind of aspect. And it's actually daylight outside. You can see the light coming in from outside. Can we talk to this fella? Stop using heavy equipment. Uh, the game to be stupid. Oh, they took Pico! That's such a horrible name. But we're gonna go save this man's Pico. Let's go. Let's go get him. A pony da. This will be a good one for Flareon to take down. It should have nothing that's really effective against it. Growl. I want to hire some fire time moving thing. Helping hand is going to go into the trash as soon as we can. Come and get some then. Quit backing up. Quit backing up. Ooh, eradicate. See, fully evolved Pokemon need a lot more XP than regular ones, so. I'm cool with fighting fully evolved ones. Oh, wow. But well, I guess it is kind of a lower level than, uh, I was, but it's fully evolved, so I thought maybe it would tank that a little bit more and not do it as much, but it, it did quite a bit. And 148 XP. Let's do it. Yeah, you stole a freaking Wingle. You thought it would be useful? You could go to the beach and catch 20 of them suckers. Seal. So, I think the move here is to switch. Haha, <laughs> switch train on the higher level, especially with like Seal, I know it has probably water type moves in its arsenal and I am NOT trying to deal with that. We'll hit it with a mud shot and it missed, of course it did. Why wouldn't it hit this? <sighs> Try mud shot again. There we go. Any type of low accuracy moves I'm gonna have to try and avoid with Marshawn because it just can't, it just can't. So we got 21 now. And some of these stats of speed is slow. Ugh. Uh, career and crimes comes to a dead end. So I'm gonna be better at randomizing too. I'm not like real sure what's going on. But all I have to do is steal some package from Devin. You want it back badly? Take it. So now we have received the Devin goods. Excellent. And now the Pico is rescued for this man. Pico, am I glad to see you're safe? Pico owes her life to you. They call me Mr. Briny and you are. Yes, yes, I am Devin. The owner of the pedal book. Uh, blah, blah, blah. I now have the Devin Goods. Devin has the Devin Goods. Let's do some quick grinding in here. Once we get Flareon up to where he knows some fire type moves. What the heck? Took me forever to encounter anything. I'm like, what the heck is going on? I want Flareon to get to, like, close to level 20. And, uh, I would hope that it would learn some fire-type moves by then, but... Honestly, I don't even know. So, tackle the Raticate to death. We should be getting real close to 16. Ah, there we go. I didn't know if we would get it or not. So our attack is really high, defense is low, everything else is ember, finally. Uh, but we're going to definitely delete a helping hand that absolutely does nothing. It's one of the most useless moves ever. Excellent. 
So we got Flareon up to 16. I'm going to try and not lose anymore. I want to keep the layout the same. I don't want to lose anybody. The uh, only thing that I want in the layout to change is if we add another one or if we uh, add a gym badge to the layout. But as you can see, we got the first one in three episodes. So now we're going to go to Petalburg Woods, I do believe. And this dude is all out. You think you might tell her I can go back to digging. Okay, so now we can go in here. What's in here? Uh, you have to cross the sea. Did you for the slate port and travel through Mauville? Okay, the rest of the tunnel there. Uh, but we had to stop. Turns out that we would have a negative effect on a lot of Pokemon in the area. Okay, do you have anything important? Command digging way. Zipper to get through. He says that if you dig low by low without using machines, you want to show the Pokemon. Whatsoever. Alright, so let's go this way. Hopefully it's something that we can... Oh yeah. I can probably honestly take this out with one tap. And I'm going to. So we're going to stop by the Pokemon Center. Heal up. Oh, it lived. We're going to stop by the Pokemon Center and heal up. And then we, we out you. Um, so we've been recording for 11 minutes. This is a little different. I'm actually using OBS instead of Elgato or Streamlabs. As you guys know, if you follow me, if you keep up with this stuff, I was using the last overlay was on Streamlabs. Oh, how did it go, the Devin Goods you did? You really are a great trainer. I'd like to give you another great ball. Thank you! Uh, excuse me, please come with me. Okay. So, Devin Corporation office is on this floor. Anyway, I can tell you how much I'm grateful for what you've done. And by the way, the parcel that you got back for us, could I get you to deliver that to the shoe garden slave port? It would be awful if those robbers are taking in. So could I count on you to do that for me? Could you wait a second? Okay. So if you guys follow me, I know uh, I use Streamlabs for the overlay to record because it was something. I wanted something on it until I was able to figure out this stuff and I kind of sat down, watched a couple tutorials and I was able to nail it. Mr. Stone, President of the Devon Corporation, you've saved our staff not once but twice, I have a favor to ask of you, blah blah blah, delivering a package of slaveware to the shipyard, on the way, could you stop off in Duford Town, a letter to Stephen in Duford. Yes, I can do that. And we can get our other gym badge here too, as well as, well as like a counter or two. Nothing in return, that's why I want you to have this, Pokenav. Device. It's a Pokemon, Pokemon Navigator or Pokemon Navigator. So it is an indispensable tool for any trainer on an adventure. It's a map of Pokemon region. You can check the locations of Dewport and Slayport easily. Excellent. So let's uh, let's get the hell out of here and go to Dewport. And then we can uh, deliver the letter. So I don't know if we healed or not. We are not healed. So we will go heal, and I honestly want to switch train my Ghastly a little bit. I feel like that could be crucial. So we've got four on the team, and I want to go add some more. That's what, that's what I'm hoping for, we go add some more to the squad. I'm going to... Oh, shit. I'm going to switch train Ghastly a little bit, and I'm going to give him the lucky egg. Item give, give him the lucky egg. Excellent. And now let's check and see how many Pokemon we have. Oh, we've got plenty. We should be fine to catch our next encounter. Devin, how's your Pokedex coming along? Pretty decent. So I ran out of Pokeballs. Okay. What are these? I'm gonna take these. I think those awaken from sleeping, maybe? No, that's Chestnut. That's Chestnut. I don't know what these do. They do something. I'm not sure. Lepaberries. Yes. Does this old lady battle you? If you see berries running. Chesto! Speaking of, there we go! 
Uh, it's up to you whether you go berries. I wonder if I can... No. I was wondering if he would want to battle again. He's an easy one. Uh -huh. So, there's nobody that we can train again, or battle again right off the bat. Do we have the HM for cut? No. We have Rock Tomb, and that's that. Okay. Yeah. I just wanted to hurry up, and I want to pick these. And we can't get an encounter here. It's the same realm. But that's okay, though. Intimidate. Damn. Intimidate? Okay, we're gonna switch out to Marsh Stomp. He gets hit with an Ember that does nothing after a critical hit. And bye bye. One water gun. About 16 minutes in, and I think I'm gonna. This episode, I should have already cut the uh, intro out. I think I'm gonna avoid using that for a little bit and see how that goes over. I feel like it's just kind of long. You know, a star piece. Excellent. I can sell that for good money. I'm gonna cut the intro out and not use it for a little while and see how that goes. And maybe I might slap it on to end. But I don't know. I'm gonna try it and see how it goes. So we can just get straight into the uh, the videos. Oh, a grobile. I can actually switch into Flareon and get out. Bye bye, Ghastly, and hello, Flareon. Quick attack, it wouldn't have affected Ghastly anyway. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I want. I want, it, I want normal moves to not be able to affect me. Excellent. Ghastly gained 60, Flareon gained 40. Okay, so let's go here. Talk to this man. Hold on, last. Wait up, Pico. Your Devin, you saved my darling. Pico, yes. You need to sell me, yes. You for dinner package for Slateport, then? Yes, it is a busy life. You come to the right man. Set sail for Duford, yes. <coughs> so, this is technically a new route here. Actually, Duford Town. I think you get the. Yes, I hear you, and I like what you're saying. I'll give you one of my fishing rods. So this is the old rod, and we can actually get an encounter. I'll even throw in a little fishing device. Base of water needs a rod. Okay, so, but with the bigger catches, you need to time the pulls on your rod and haul them in. So, technically, this is Route 107. This is due for town round, so I can technically get an encounter here, which is awesome. This is like an extra encounter. But hopefully we can nab something up. Not even a nibble. <laughs> we'll just keep trying. A Pokemon's on the hook. Here we go. Uh, I get so nervous. I was super focused. A Kingler! This is a pretty nice Pokemon to have, I guess. So we'll switch out to Flareon. This might be a bad idea, though. So this is Leer. Okay. Let's hit it with an Ember. That's good, though. It doesn't do... It does big damage, but it doesn't... I'm really afraid of that freaking Leer. We'll hit it with one more ember, hopefully no crit, no kill. Excellent. Now we're gonna catch a sucker. And I'm probably gonna write down like where I got an encounter. Because I don't wanna I don't wanna catch any illegals. So here we go. Pokeball on the Kingler. Oh, oh this is what I was afraid of. Okay, it doesn't, it doesn't do, like, anything. I'm going to throw the Great Ball at it. I kind of want this Kingler onto the team. One. Not looking good here. Not looking good here, folks. So 
I'm gonna switch out to Marsh Stomp to tank some of these hits. He's just gonna leer me too. This sucks. Uh, so we have 14 more tries here. Come on, stay in. Almost had it, almost had it. Two rolls. Come on. It's not one to stay in. I'm gonna have to heal, I bet. That or I'm just gonna kill it. Ten more tries. We've already burnt through six of them, I think. It is not liking it. It is not wanting to stay in that freaking ball for nothing. Come on. We're in the yellow too. If it gets us down anymore, I'm gonna have to kill it. I can't even catch a freaking Kingler. I'm gonna heal. Okay. It's okay, this is okay. We can tank that. We got six more attempts, we might as well just go for it. I'm gonna kill it. I've wasted too much time and I don't feel like messing with it. Kingler fainted. Gas again's good experience though. 132. And he learned Spike. Gas grew to level 9. Marsh Tom getting 88 points and Flareon getting 88 XP. So there's that. So now we are going to try our luck. Actually, do they have a bar? So what I'm going to do is heal and I think Brawly is not in there right now. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to switch. Maybe Brawly is in here. Oh, it's just, I don't know, Flash. Okay. That's that way. Okay, here we go. Oh, we should have switched. I forgot Ghastly was up front. Cacturn. And then his moves are super effective against him. So it's okay, we'll switch to Flareon. No big freaking deal. Leer. We'll hit it with an ember. Should should knock it out. If it doesn't, it should get it close. Very close. Very close in Growth. Let's just raise attack. Special attack. Okay. Ember again. There it is. Cacturn down and out for the count. 397 experience points. Ghastly is growing right now. 265 for Flareon. Good, good XP, good XP. So that was pretty good, but i am gotten lucky, uh, and I want to... Oh no, this is where we learn Flash. So I am not doing that again. Now I am going to switch Marsh Stomp in, because... And during this, I am going to... Take the lucky egg from Gasly just in here, and I'm going to give the lucky egg to Marshawn. There it is. And then what I'm going to do is, once we are out of here, we're going to go back and get some balls. We'll go up this way, this way. Oh, we ran into a trainer. No need for Brawly to be here. He'll, he'll crush me. Okay. Not concerned. Battle Girl and Agron. 
Okay, my water gun should be super effective here. And it is. And it's just not enough to one shot. Harden, not scary move, not a scary move at all. Hit it with another water gun. And there it is. Done. 789 experience. Holy crap. This, this is for real. That lucky egg is for real. Well, let's hit it with a mud shot. I feel like that would do more damage than the other two moves. And it does. And one shot. One shot. 531 experience. Up to 22. Um, everything's good, but the speed. The speed is ass. Slow king. So a pretty decent battle, one shot at like everything. 631 experience there. Marsh Stomp is gonna get an insane amount of levels in this gym. And we're gaining money too, so. So we can now see a little bit more. I wonder if there's anything down here. I'm actually okay with it. We're doing really well in this gym. We're at a pretty high level actually compared to everything that they have in here. So Black Belt, he sends out Gramble. Not a big deal at all. Not a big deal at all. We're gonna hit it with a mud shot. And it one shots critical hit. I don't know if it mattered or not, but if it did, there you go. 800 experience, dude. We're getting so much experience with this uh, lucky egg. Heck yes. Not enough power. There can't be many more trainers left, honestly, because... Oh, I think Brawly's right up here. Yeah, this is Brawly. Here we go. Pitch Black Cave, so you wanted to challenge me. Let's see what you're made of. Come on, Brawly. Give it all you thought. So this is how we're going to end the episode here. This is probably where we're going to end it. Uh, Leader Rachel. What's up, Rachel? Marsh Stomp. Uh, I'm going to hit it with a water gun. I'm pretty sure Hound Doom is part Fire type? Dark and fire, I think. Should be super effective. It is. Does about half. Does about half. Ember, that won't do anything to me. The only thing that sucks though is if we get a grass type out here. Quad weak. Quad <laughs> weak. Jesus, that's insane. Come on, let me learn something good. Let me learn something Splout. No. We'll be fine. Here we go. Um, let's hit it with Mud Shot. It's, of course. How? It's going to raise his own attack. Yes. Yes. So let's, let's try a Mud Slap. It'll lower his accuracy a little bit there. Okay. Gonna raise his attack again. This is actually getting kind of scary. Uh, let's hit it with a water gun. That does an okay amount of damage. He is setting up his attack. A brawl is gonna be insane. I'm gonna hit it with another much mud slap. Lower his, lower his accuracy some more. So hopefully his attack misses. That's what I'm talking about. And he's gonna heal with a super potion. Doesn't quite get all the way up to full though. And I'm just gonna keep lowering this man's accuracy because if he hits that up roar, it's gonna be a bad friggin' time. He's raised his attack like three or four times. He's raising it again, dude. You better just go for it because you've got like two more chances unless you've got another super potion. Oh. His attack missed. <laughs> Thank gosh for freaking accuracy lowering moves. He's gonna be like, have no accuracy. There's so much mud slapped into his eyeballs. So let's hit him with a mud shot now. There we go. There we go. GG, Brawly. GG. Almost level 25 on the Marsh Stop. We swept that cleanly. One one Pokemon whole gym swept it. That's what I'm talking about. But I think there was one trainer that we got lucky and didn't have to fight. We received the knuckle badge from Brawly. 
Fuck yeah. There we go. The Knuckle Badge makes all Pokemon up to level 30, even those you get in trades. Obey without question. HM move flash outside of battle. What do we get? TM08. What is that? TM08. Both up. Both attack and defense stats. Oops. Alright, so we can end this episode by going back to... No, I think we hit literally every trainer. We can end this episode by going back because we can get an encounter over there on 107. Yes, we're going back to Helber. And we need to go get Pochi Balls. Excellent. And then we'll also heal up while we're here, but we'll start that off. Um, let's sell. Let's sell our star piece. We don't need this. We don't need that. Um, we don't need this. A hold item that restores any lowered stat. We'll keep that, I guess. And that's it. that to sell, and we'll keep that to sell, or, or teach along the way. And now we want to buy, all we can buy is freaking Pokeballs. And I think I'm going to buy 20 of them. And, and then we're going to buy some potions. I think that's going to end the episode, guys. Thank you guys very much for watching. If you did enjoy, be sure to smash that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. And be sure to check out some of my other stuff on the channel if you haven't yet already. If you enjoy just me in general, check out some of my other stuff. I'm working on a Skyrim Let's Play. You should check that out if you haven't yet already. Uh, also, follow me on Facebook at Devinator Gaming, Same as the channel. And also follow me on Twitter at Devinator17 where I keep you updated with what I've got going on. Post some good stuff over there. Be sure to follow me over there. Both of those links will be in the description. Thank you guys very much for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next one.